lot of people have been asking me about my impressions. I get a lot of questions about how to begin doing impressions. This is going to be a three-part series. If this helps anyone out there, then that's that's great. And also, I want to point out this is this is only my way of doing it. There are probably as many different ways out there as there are people who do impressions. So bear that in mind. It might not work for you. It might well work for you. Um, but this is this is how I do it. So how to do impressions. I think the first thing to know is that it doesn't just start automatically. You can't just leap in there and and do De Niro or or walk in. It takes a, a bit of um a bit of work. That's that's certainly certainly what I've discovered. The first thing you want to do is you want to decide who you want to do uh, an impression of. So let's say I wanted to do an impression of Colin Firth. Um, I want to do an impression of Colin Firth. How do I begin? Well, do I start by listening to everything Colin Firth's done, watching everything he's ever done? Uh, that's one way to begin. Might be some people's way. That's not my way. What I do um, is I would just, the first thing I do is, is take, Colin inside of me and sort of ease him in and then once he's in there just let him let him live inside it for a little bit and then if you if you do that um, you'll start to to feel like Colin um, I mean I don't mean that in a, in a, fit, in a fit you're not going to be saying the same things as him you're not going to be you're not going to be ordering the same coffee as him but you might find uh that when you get the coffee uh from starbucks that the barista might say here's your coffee and you go thanks but that's the sort of thing that colin would have done so just those little things you let you let them live inside of you for a little while and then what you do is you kind of um you sit sit down on your couch and you begin so not even, not even, you're not even using your vocal cords. You'll notice that. We're not even going to get that to that yet. But what you do is you just think of things that Colin Firth would... Well, how would he look around the room? I'll do it. I'll do it for you now. This is, uh, this is, this is Colin. See what I mean? I was not Colin Firth then, but I was certainly inhabiting his character. Um, so that's that's really the first thing, and you could do that with a lot of other people. I'll do I'll do an, I'll do another one. Um, this is uh, Tom Cruise. This is Tom Cruise. Sorry, it takes me a little while to get. Hang on. Okay, this is Tom. This is Tom Cruise. So that's really the first step, is just to get inside, get inside Tom, or have him get inside you. One thing you don't want to do is to have both Tom and Colin in, inside of you at the same time, because that can be difficult, um, uncomfortable is, is the way um, I put it. That's just my way uh, of beginning to do uh, impressions. Part two uh, will be uh, coming soon, and uh, that's when we move on to the real, the real good stuff. So uh, see you then, and uh, I hope I hope this has been helpful. Thank you.